Though they did lose for the first time this past Thursday, it's been an impressive start to the season for the Osseo baseball team. They enter a busy week with a 5-1 and one record. CCX Sports' Jay Wilcox caught up with the Orioles. Guys uh, had a tough one with Andover, but obviously it's going to be tough to go undefeated through a season. Is that a game you can kind of learn from a little bit too? Yes, we can learn from that. It's early in the season still, and mistakes happen, and people learn from it, and hopefully we'll learn them down the road and make better things happen. You guys got a, a busy week in the week ahead here with four games, including three of them right here at home. And, you know, how much fun is this week uh, potentially going to be against a couple section opponents too? Yeah, it'll be big. We'll see some uh, section opponents here, and hopefully we get a win on all of them and put us on top of the section again. So, John Bezicek been been uh, very strong on the hill. You know, how much fun has it been to go out there and, you know, put some innings together, put some good innings together along with your brother? Um, it's been it's been a blast actually, but having the defense behind us, making only a couple of errors this year so far, um, is something I think I can trust in the future, and I will. And uh, I'm just excited to see what we can do later in the season. Uh, we just got to take it one game at a time, and the big thing is the playoffs. So we just got to learn each game and know what we got to do, fill our roles. For your program and uh, for Maple Grove, moving into a uh, different section a couple years back, you know, is it if you kind of to the point where you're used to those teams now and you you know know what to expect from playing them in the season a little bit too? Uh, yeah, you know, uh, a couple of years ago we we uh, our conference schedule has changed, so it's given us the opportunity to get some more of those non-conference games against those section opponents. So when we get to section play, uh, we kind of have an idea of what we're getting into. Um, obviously, you know, those northern schools, you know, Moorhead or Brainerd, they're tough to get on the schedule, but um, you know, the close ones like a St. Michael or Buffalo, you know, it's nice to, nice to see them at least once uh, throughout the year. So we're ready for them at the end. The Orioles are scheduled to have home games Wednesday and Friday with a road game Saturday this week. That's if the weather cooperates.